what's the word for today? <laughs> we'll have to see. Uh, I'm not really good at these things, but I think it's like a nice thing to kind of like have a little bit of brain teaser, right? In the morning time, give or take. Yeah. You haven't done it yet? Oh, well, that's good. Um, five, in, in case you don't know about Wordle, um, if, if you like games like Wordle, just stick around for like the next 30 minutes and we're going to be playing a lot of different kinds of these games. I'll go ahead and show you and maybe you'll learn something new and uh, find a new kind of brain teaser game that you can play every single day. Uh, so stick around for sure. Um, today's word is F. I don't even know. Um, I don't know, like the meta. What if I said treat? What's the meta for like five words? Okay, so obviously we know it's, there's an E, but it's out of place, of course. Yeah. Yeah. Yesterday's was tricky. I feel like th they're just throwing random stuff out there. Um, head, 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 hedge, hedge. Hedge, no. Back. Hedgy. That sounds weird. Um. Edgar. <laughs> no, not Edgar. <laughs> Can't be that. Oh my god. Jammy Socks. Hey, Jammy Socks. Thanks for using your Prime subscription. I appreciate you. Hello. I don't have the alert on the screen, which is dumb of me. I should probably. What? Well, do I have the alert on the screen? Maybe not. I don't have the alert on the screen. Um, hang on a sec. Let me see if I can fix that. Um, oh, there we go. There's Kojo coming in. Uh, let's see. Let's move this. Uh, copy. Come back here. Do a little bit of this and do a little bit of that. There we go. There we go. Now you have the alerts on this side. I know. Yeah. Thank you for the Prime subscription. I appreciate that. And Kamikaze Chimp, thank you for following as well. Hello. Good to see you too. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Me and your mom send our results every day to each other. Well, uh... Who's better? <laughs> Who's better between the two? Uh, mead? No, it can't be M E A. Mead? M mellow. Mellow? That's not a word. Um, mel mel melon. That is a word. Okay, we have an E in its spot. We have an L that we found. Melon. Melon. Hello, Flight Medic. How are you? Good to see you. Um, uh, not, I mean, it doesn't mean that it's L right there, but Lek, uh, Lek, Lem, Lem, Pull, oh God, it could be anything. P, uh p p e p i no p e i no um h do we do an h no we did not do an h h e h e i H E I H Thank you Kaisha uh, Kaya Kai Kayasha Kayasha thank you for following hello good to see you good morning to you beast uh beats sorry hello good morning to you um G E G E B E Also Lindsay, hello Lindsay. Thank you for using your Prime and subscription on me too. How are you, Lindsay? Hello. Good morning, good day, good afternoon to you. B B's knees. And that's a hype train apparently. I don't know what a hype train is. Oh Kai Kai Kayasha, Kayasha, thank you for using your Prime subscription as well. Hello. Good morning to you. You. This is a tough one, dude. Oh, heels? Can't be heels. We have an A crossed out. Um, K E. K 
K-E? K-E-I? K-E-U? K-E-P? Kep? Kep. Uh, ooh. Can we, well, I don't know if there's double E's. There's probably not double E's. What if we did keeps? You bastard. Okay. There's no K, there's no P, and there's no S. D E. D E. D E. Oh, you. Oh, wow. D E. U. C E. Deuce. But there's not two E's, so it can't be that. Ducci. Yeah. <laughs> what the heck is Ducci? Ducci. Um. Oh, well, wait a sec. Do. Um. Y e. Y e. A yucca? No, that's a yucca. <laughs> Not a yucca. <laughs> um. My lord. Be e bewitched. Be here. I hate you bees. Be beauty. Nope. By oh, wow, this is this is fantastic. Oh yeah, that's right. There's an L, huh? Oh shoot. Can't be lead, though. So. There is an L. I forgot there's an L. My God. Well, what would it be L E? Maybe it could be L E. L E. L E D. L E. This is not a word. L E I. F. That's not how. You... No, that's not a word. I, I, I agree. I, I typed it in, though. I don't even know if it's L-E. Lev? Levy? Lev? Love you? I love you? L-U? L-E-U? You... Fricker. L E U D, Ludi. Ludi? <laughs> That's not a word either. Ludi? No! Can't be Ludi. Leb. Uh oh. I gotta get my phone away. Ah. Okay. Um. I mean, it might not be hooked on L E. F E L. Let's do F E L. Can we do F E L? No, it can't be there. F E. F E. F E. Beauty? Is that a word? That is not a word. Feuds? Also not a word. F E I Well it can't be Feudy, you frick, there's an L in it. That's right. What about Fell? Z can't be that either. I I think it's gonna be L E something. Yeah, I think it's gonna be L E something. L E something. Dun dun dunk it dunk. L E I'm I'm getting so stumped. Beast? There's no A or S or T. <laughs> L E something sounds good. Go with that. Feuds? 
Um, there needs to be an L. What about, oh, what about cello? There's no O. You, Chelly? <laughs> Selly? What about Selly? Selly? Oh, we got a Y. Okay, so we have Y. Okay, so we have E, Y. There's an L going somewhere. Maybe L, E, something, something, Y. L, E, something, something, Y. We did this, didn't we? Yeah, that's that's not a word. L E something something Y. E is in the wrong place. Uh, that is incorrect. E is in the correct place. Leary, there is no double E's. A Millie by Lil Wayne. Good guess. Levy, Levy, Levy. Love you. Love you. <laughs> uh, we only have two guesses left. At least we know there's a Y. You think the L's in the wrong place? Well, that one is. Yeah, that one was. Um, this is bonkers, dude. No, I was going to say jelly. I was going to say jelly, dude. But that doesn't work. That would have been a good one. Um, hmm. What about welly? What about well? What about wetly? Wet? No. What about wetty? Wedly? Wedly? What the frick is that? Not a word. That's what that is. Um... Uh, <laughs> F. We're spending way too much time on Wordle today. Wet fell. Uh, feudly, feudy, feudy pie. It's said we done feudy. Feudy's not a word. Not a word. Ludley's too long. Truth. Leafy. No e and no or sorry no a. Hello, fungus head. How are you? L has to be in the first position. Uh, yeah, you're right. L does have to be in the first position. So it has to go L E <clears throat> and then something, something Y. We have to put two letters in between Y with L E. It has to be L. Lezzy. What the frick did I just say? Ludi. Have we done a do? D. You frick. Ludi's not a word. Lufer. Luffy? This is not a word. Luby? <laughs> Lebby? Luby. It's Luby. It's not Luby. Not Luby. Not a not a leggy? No, it's not that. No, it is that. No, it could be that. I mean, it could be that. Oh my god, it's that. Hey, it's Leggy. Let's go. Hooray. Good job, everybody. GG's. Next one. This is Guess the Game. You only get six guesses. Um, So, from a clip of this game, what game is this? I am going to say this is... Metal Gear? This is not Metal Gear. This is Super Smash Bros. Okay, that is not Super Smash Bros. Uh, this had a Metacritic score of 96%. Dude, I don't know. Um, this looks like some sort of fighting game backdrop. Assassin's Creed Breath of the Wild? Is that what Breath of the Wild looks like? 
That looks too cartoonish to be Assassin's Creed. It looks like a backdrop for like Street Fighter. Not Street Fighter. Uh, what are the other ones? Tekken? <laughs> Tekken? It looks like a fighting game. That's what that looks like. Uncharted. That's a good one. Uncharted. Which one though? Uh, Uncharted 2. Submit. <laughs> it's Uncharted 2. I sniped that from chat. <laughs> I would have never guessed Uncharted 2. I've never played any of the Uncharted's before. Sick. Good job. Good job. Uh, this is also guess the game. Uh, game Dole Classic, though. This is Classic Games. Uh, guess the game. You have six lives remaining. 2,187 people have already guessed this. Um, I don't think it's Mega Man. Uh, Star Fox? That's not Star Fox. It's not Mega Man either. What the hell is that? What is that? Um, I don't know what that could be. Um, this is a hard one. Um, this is. I'm just going to say Mega Man. I know it's not Mega Man, but maybe we'll get like... Okay, there's a little bit of a guessing there. Okay, what the frick is that? Okay. I have no idea what that is. What is that? What? Um... Assassin's Creed Black Flag? Uh, Civ, Sid Meier Civilization. I don't know which one. C uh, four, five, six, three, two, one. Uh, hit me with six. Oh, shit, dude. Is that Age of Empires? Age of Mythology? That's not Age of Mythology, is it? We have two lives left. I was thinking Civilization. I was thinking Age of Empires, Age of Mythology. That has to be some sort of Civ game. That has to be some sort of 4X game. Is that a 4X game? Civilization 6? Did we do that one? We did that one already. This is Age of Empires. This is Age of Empires 4. <laughs> ah! The frick is that, man? Last guess. Talos Principle Two. What the fuck was it? Talos Principle Two. I put one. You bastard. <laughs> ah! It was Talos Principle. It was one. I put two. I could have got it right. I could have got it right. All right. All right. All right. Got me there. Uh, this is Game Dell artwork. Uh, this is 100% like South Park, dude. This is South Park, I think, right? This looks like South Park. This is probably not South Park. Okay, double guessing. It's not South Park. I'm going to hit you with shite. <laughs> okay, it looked like South Park, but maybe... I don't know what the heck that is. Dragon Quest? South Park, a fractured butthole. I'll just guess it. That's yeah, Super Mario, dude. Soup. That's Paper Mario. That's Paper Mario, dude. Paper Mario. Uh, in the Origami King. You bastard! I got you. Hooray! All right, next one. This is Game Duel. So Game Duel is like you have to figure out which game they're going. You have a lot of you know, this many guesses. You have eight guesses to figure out what game it is. So I'm just going to say a random game to try to give us some clues. This game is Assassin's Creed Black Flag. Okay, it is not Assassin's Creed Black Flag. It is in the genre of platform and adventure. 
and it is a third part it is a third person game by the way hello sleepy sloth thanks for following good to see you it's a platform adventure game third person and it was released before 2013. What's a third person adventure platform game released before 2013? Spyro? Spyro? Game mode, it is a single player game, but it was also released after 1998. But it's a third person single player adventure platform game released after 1998 same saga wrong saga wrong saga i think we have something in here though it's not ubisoft but it could be something over here potentially what's a single player third person had spongebob battle for bikini bottom shit release after 2003 now release after prince of persia i think that was before i think that was in the 90s playstation one era potentially was there more prince of persia's prince of persia i don't know which one came prince of persia forgotten oh uh, no that is not the right way but it was released before 2010. So before 2010, okay, between 2003 and 2010. Oh yeah, Ubisoft, it wasn't Ubisoft, that's right. It's Sony. Or Universal, or Insomniac. It's probably Insomniac. I don't know much of an Insomniac games that were released between 2010 and 2003. Better a platform adventure? Uh, I don't know. Was Rayman Insomniac? I feel like Rayman possibly was. Rayman 2? Rayman 2 was 1999? That was Ubisoft 2? God damn it. Hello, Urban Ghost. Hello, Lady Fluffy Dragon. Good to see you. Uh, I didn't know Rayman 2 was 1999. We're running out of time. We need to burn through this pretty quickly. Uh, let's throw in some more guesses. Um, third person platform. Uh, what was that one? Psychonauts? Psychonauts? I don't know how to spell it. S how do you spell it? Psych? There it is. Psychonauts? Okay, we're going the wrong direction. It was, it was, it was before 2005. So it had been a game in 2004. By Warner Brothers, possibly. Batman. That seems way too... Lego Batman? Third person platform. This is starting to be a Lego game, I feel like. Lego Batman. Lego Batman, the video game. You bastard. That was in 2008? I thought they came out a lot. Uh, oh, Ratchet and Clank. I, can't, I don't know. Who, who does Ratchet and Clank? Did Ubisoft do Ratchet and Clank? That's a good one. Oh, it's by it, it has a kinetic uh, game engines. I didn't realize Ratchet and Clank came out in 2002, though. That's a good guess, though. What about Insomnia? What about Ratchet and Clank? Ratchet and Clank. Um... Up your arsenal. It was on the PS2, PS3, and the PS Vita. And it was released in 2004, the same year as Ratchet and Clank. We have one guest left. I'm I'm smoked, dude. I I don't know any games that came out in 2004. <laughs> hey Tool Gaming. Hey Lucy. Thanks for following. Good to see you. Hello. I'm smoked, dude. I'm absolutely smoked. What game came out in uh, 2004? Grand Theresa? No, that's third part. Wait, third person? Adventure platform? Adventure platform, PS2, PS3, third person. 
single player game. Yeah. And I don't think it's by EA. Oh, I guess we haven't put down an EA guess, huh? Single player game, 2004, only exclusive. It's, an, it's a PlayStation exclusive. We can at least kind of like do that. PlayStation exclusive. Yeah. Was Neverwinter a uh, PlayStation exclusive? This is a PlayStation exclusive that nobody knows about. <laughs> that happened in 2004. Third person that could have been done by Sony or could have been done by Insomniac. Neither were PlayStation. I guess we're going to find out here. PlayStation exclusive? Resident Evil? Was Resident Evil PlayStation exclusive? What's wrong? What's the same saga? Oh, I see. Yeah, so it's not... I should have read that. Uh, it definitely wasn't going to be the second Ratchet & Clank if it was in the wrong freaking saga. I don't know who uses Kinetic Game Engine. I'm just going to shoot a shot in the dark. What's a PlayStation exclu exclusive in, in 2004? I don't know. I don't know. Um... It's going to be something off the wall, isn't it? Insomniac, dude. Insomniac is going to be the death of me. I know this isn't right, but I want to know. Sly Cooper! One of the most, like, like, one of the most, like, iconic games on PlayStation. God damn it. All right. Chrono Photo. Uh, what year was this photo taken? Uh, look at their outfits. That door is massive. This is definitely taken in like 1937. 1923? Are you kidding me? Okay. Next. Okay. This is, I'm getting a little bit of 70s vibes, possibly 80s vibes. This shirt kind of looks 80s. Somebody's winning, someone could potentially win $1 million. This is 1982. That was 1996? You're out of your freaking mind, dude. I guess $1 million probably would have gave that away, but everything else looks like they're still stuck in the 80s. This is like a casino that you saw on the like the side of the road in like Reno, Nevada. 1996, you're out of control. Tatsuru. Hello, Tatsuru. Thank you for following. Good to see you. Oh, God. Look at them. They're painting a book. <laughs> what era are they painting a book? The book cover? <laughs> Holy shit, dude. Look at these outfits. This is like... Oh, look at her. She's all like dressed... Typewriter? Typewriter? When did they use type? This is like... It's like... Is this like the 40s? Is this like 1940? No, I'm going to get shafted here. This is going to be like 1920 or something. Or This is 1935. It's actually 1947. I should have went with my gut on the 40s. God damn it. Rentas Parala Cotura. I don't know if I said that right. Probably did not. Um, I mean, I don't really have any much information because I'm just culturally lack of awareness here. I'm just trying to go based off of just how they dress, really, at this point. I mean, these people are all dressed very semi-casual, professional. This is potentially the 50s. It's 1950. It's actually 1967. What the frick? Okay, people are playing... Uh, what is that called? Water polo? Or... I don't know what the hell that is. In... a uh, Water next to the Washington Memorial. Okay, look how the women are dressed in, in their bikinis, their bathing suits. This is definitely... Look at the... Look at the women. This is 1920s. This is... 
1921. You just know by the way they dress, that would not fly a hundred years later. Like, girls don't wear anything anymore. All right, that was five out of five. Next is Housel. Uh, this is a house that was sold in Texas. This is insane. How much was this house sold for in Texas? This is easily a $5 million house. That's too low? Yeah, that makes sense. There's no crying in Housel. Okay. This is the inside. This is a $12 million house. That's too high. 83 miles away from Dallas, Texas. 10 bedrooms, 10 and a half bath. This is a $10 million house. That's also too high. This is 11,000 square feet and 10 million is too high. This is a $8 million house. Too high? This is a castle. It's Texas. Two, almost two and a half acres. This is no way. This is a $6 million house. $6 million is too high for a castle. Last clue. Serving both as a Cheshire primary residence and enchanting event space. What were my previous guesses? Okay, so it's between five and six million. Five point five million dollars. I won. I got it correct. It was five point five million dollars. God damn. All right, time guesser. We have two more. And then we gotta go start our YouTube stream. What the frick is this? City Stan Stad Durban. Where is this located? I don't know where City slash Stad Stad Durban. This is English. This is not English anymore. This is somewhere in Europe, but I don't know where. I'm gonna put it on the uh, coast of F. What year is this? This is like 1933, 34. This is 1930 frick. This is 19, this is 1931. Somewhere on a beach. That's South Africa? And South Africa? You think that's Cape Town over here? Okay, fine. I'll do 1931 somewhere in Cape Town-ish area. Does Cape Town have a beach? T table Bay. Place me there. Where was this? Racial segregation on Durban Beach of 1986? It was South Africa. That's 1986? I guess they have color, huh? <laughs> they do have a color uh, picture. They aren't dressing like they're in 1986, are they? It's in South Africa, though. Yeah, that was a pretty good guess. Good job. I give you, I tip my cap. Okay, I don't know where this... I, I mean, I know-ish where that's at, but... That's the freaking thing, right? <laughs> that's the th Where is this on the map? This is in Europe. What year is this? Whenever they had a bus and a horse. They have a horse carriage and a bus. This is Spain? This is Madrid? Who... When time period had buses and horses existing on the same road? In 1928 in Spain. I got to go fast here. We're going to be late to our other stream. 1940? Where was that at? Catalonia? Outside of Catalonia? Sure, brother. Cole, not Dole. Get off the fence. Join us now. Cole, not Dole. I don't... I don't... This is definitely 60s. We are in the... We're... I think 1962 is a safe bet, but where are we in the coal is the dole? Coal, not the dole. This is the UK, you think? Yorkshire, England? 
Is that where that's at? Where the frick is Yorkshire? Manchester? Where's Yorkshire? North UK? Liverpool? You think that's 1985? That looks like the 60s, dude. Is that 80s? They had something to live for in the 60s, man. I'm going to say here. That's the 70s? I don't believe you. I'm going I'm going 62. That was 1984. <laughs> There's no way. That's that you were dressed like that in 1980. You fricks. I mean, yeah. I mean, we know where that's at. This is more modern. This looks like the 80s, dude. This is more like, yeah. Where the f is Paris? There it is. Smack and dab in the middle of Paris. This is like, oh wait, this is old. Oh, look at the cars though. Shite, dude. I don't know. This is like maybe the 50s, 60s. This is 60s. 1965. 1961. Okay. That was close. Last one. Uh, can somebody... Can, Susie, can you push my YouTube like 15 minutes back? Just, uh, just 15 minutes, please. I would appreciate that. Union Democratica. Cratica. Argentina? This is Argentina? Where the hell is Argentina? I feel ridiculous. Where's Argentina? South America. Where the hell is Argentina? This is like... Nazism? This is like 30s? 40s? Argentina? Southern South America? Brazil, Venezuela, Honduras. Oh, there it is right there. Uh, what city in Argentina? <laughs> Your guess is as good as mine, brother. This is like 1945. Yeah, I'm spot on. Thank you. All right. Very good. Good job. 31,000 out of 50,000. It wasn't that bad. Listed. Uh, this house was sold on January 24th at 2024. Okay. Guess the price of this house. Where is... Okay, so a lot of things happen here. Where's the location, first and foremost? That really tells the price of a house. Um, it looks like it's nowhere. It's, there's trees and stuff. I'm going to assume this is a $350,000 house. It's in California. Shit. Um... This is easily a $500,000 house. Single family home. It is lower than $500,000. It is $450,000 house. It is higher than $450,000. It is four seventy-five. dollars It is lower than 475. It's 460. Cha ching. That scared the crap out of me. Uh, this was an actual house uh, in Blairsden, California. It's a three bedroom, two bath house that was built in 1999. It is 1,600 square foot. It only sits on a 0 0.3 acre lot. It was bought. <laughs> In 2017 for $377,000, later sold in 2024, which was like a few weeks ago, for $469,000 or $470,000. Yeah. $470,000 in somewhere I've never heard of <laughs> in Blairsden, California. Um, I'm interested to know where Blairsden, California is. Hang on. Let me see where this is at. Where the hell's Blairsden? Blairsden is F. Where's Blairsden?
and yeah it's in the middle of nowhere <laughs> it's right outside the tahoe national forest all right sick brother it's in the middle of nowhere that house is in the rural area of california and it sold for four hundred and seventy thousand dollars for a three-bedroom two two bath house that was fun i like that good job ggs everybody